All right, guys. I got some excited goats here today. I'm whooped. Um, it's feed mixing day. Hey guys, here we are at Rural King again. We love coming to Rural King to get all our feed because it's really good feed and it's really good prices too. And when you buy in bulk like we do, that's exactly what you need. Now hopefully we can get all this feed got, get it all loaded and get home before the rain and then we'll show you how we mix our own goat feed. Okay, so this is what we got left for the end of this feed. We got a little bit in a box over at the uh, milking stand. But, yep, we are out. It worked out perfect. We got three months out of this mix. So, and this uh, month we'll be changing our mix a little bit. Um, this is what we had. Uh, I'm going to cut down on the corn, and I'm going to up the amount of oats and alfalfa with spring and summer coming. <clears throat> uh, they just don't need that corn for heat, and that's why I put the corn in there. The corn goes in for heat. So, I've got my mixer out here, and my feed. This month we will do... Hold on, let me get my paper. Find it in a second. I'm getting it. Okay. So, last month, or last mixing, I did four bags 12%, four bags of corn, two bags of sunflower seeds, four bags of alfalfa, and two bags of oats. 740 pound now this new mix will be four bags of 12 percent which what i'm getting isn't 12 percent it's actually 16 percent but growing up we always bought 12 percent and that's just what i've always called it it's sweet feed uh two bags of corn uh two bags of uh, sunflower seeds five bags of alfalfa and three bags of oats it'll come up to 750 pound now i actually have an extra bag of alfalfa uh i don't know if i'm gonna mix that in or not i might we'll see uh 740 pound of feed completely filled everything I could possibly fill so I'm probably not going to have the space because I've got an extra 10 pound feed I mean you know that's that's a couple of gallon uh so we'll have to see on that I, I think I'm running low on space but they dropped the price of the sweet feed this month so that helped me out I mean and I got an amazing deal on these oats. Uh, they're actually food plot oats. Um, and there's nothing really special about them. They're fresh uh, oats. It actually gives you the date that they were harvested. And, you know, they're fresher so they'll seed better. Um, they're just a higher grade of oat. So... I mean, normally these things are like $32 a bag, but clearance section, so five bucks a bag. All right, I'm going to get to mixing. Uh, <clears throat> let me spin you around here. This uh, process of mixing I do changes every single time I do it. Uh, keep in mind, though, that I'm only mixing about every three months, sometimes every four months. 
it, it all depends. I mean, in the summer, I'll mix less because they're eating, you know, whatever they can find. Grass, they love leaves, briars, anything. So that cuts down on the amount of feed we give them. Uh, it also changes on how many goats we're milking. So, as the ones that we milk, we give a little extra to. Um, but, uh, like I say, it changes every time. With us doing this, you know, so far in between, I've only had to mix feed this way, like, three times. So, three or four. Maybe it's four. But, uh... You know, everything takes time to perfect, so that's what I'm working on. All right, guys, that's what we do to mix our feed. Uh, we're done for now for mixing feed. So, guys, if you need anything, any questions whatsoever, I'm happy to help. Just let me know. I have to get back to work. I'm Will with Wild and Wonderful, and I hope you all have a good day. Bye.